The Trent Urbano is a 10.7 mile fully automated rapid transit system that serves the municipalities of San Juan, Guaynabo and Bayamon in Puerto Rico. The Trent Urbano it consists of 16 stations operating on 10.7 miles of track along a single line. The Trent Urbano complements other forms of public transportation services in the San Juan metropolitan area such as the Metropolitan Bus Authority, Catana Ferry, Taxis and Shuttles. The entire mass transportation system is operated by the Integrated Transit Authority ATI. The Trent Urbano system is operated by Alternate Concepts INC. Trent Urbano is also the Caribbean's first rapid transit system. The rail system was officially inaugurated on December 19, 2004. Popularity grew quickly and by the end of the free period, 40,000 people were using the train on a daily basis. By late 2005, however, ridership had fallen to 24,000, less than one-third of the 80,000 projection and well below the projection of 110,000 for 2010. Paid fare service started on June the 6, 2005. In 2006, average weekday boardings stood at 28,179 and in 2007 ridership decreased to 27,567. Nonetheless, by the third quarter of 2008, average weekday ridership had increased to 36,500 of passengers. The Trent Urbano has no service to Old San Juan, Santurce, the Luis Munoz Marine International Airport, nor to many other parts of Guaynabo, Bayamon and San Juan and does not serve important suburbs like Catano, Doa Baja, Doa Alta, Carolina, Trujillo, Alto, Canovanas and others, which helps to explain low ridership. Some question the viability of this system for additional reasons, such as the lack of an island-wide public transportation system, such as the TUSCA system proposed in 1971, integration with public mass transit systems, such as the AMA and the Aqua Expresso and Urban Ferry was initially poor and remains a challenge for the DTOP. Trent Urbano is currently made up of a single rapid transit route. It consists of 60 stations, 10 of which are elevated, 4 at grade or in open cuttings and 2 underground. It goes mostly through suburban areas. All stations are designed to handle 3 permanently coupled pairs, 6 vehicles. Each of the 16 stations boasts unique artwork and architectural style. A single trip costs one and half dollars, 0.75 if customers transfer from an AMA bus, including a one-hour bus transfer period. If a customer exits the station and wants to get back on the train, the full fare must be repaid. There is no train to train transfer period. Students and seniors from 60 to 74 years old pay 75 cents per trip. Senior citizens older than 75 and children under 6 ride for free. Several unlimited passes are also available. A store value multi-use fare card may be used for travel on buses as well as on trains. The value on the card is automatically deducted each time it is used. It is a system similar to the metro card system used in New York City. Trent Urbano's fleet consists of 74 Siemens stainless steel bodied card each 75 feet long. Each vehicle carries 72 seated and 108 standing passengers. Trains have a maximum speed of 62 miles per hour and average 20.6 miles per hour, including stops. All cars operate as married pairs and up to three pairs will run together at any time. Trent Urbano currently operates 15 trains during rush hours, while the remaining cars stand at the yards of serve as backup should a train experience problems. The rolling stock was assembled at the Siemens plant in Sacramento, California. Power is provided by AC traction motors chosen over DC as they contain fewer moving parts and require less maintenance. The trains share many characteristics with the stock built by Siemens for Boston MBTA's Blue Line route. It is electrified by third rail at 750 volt DC. Air conditioning systems have been specially designed to go with the hot and muggy conditions commonly experienced in the metropolitan area. The infrastructure of the Trent Urbano with stations built for 6 car train sets and a minimum headway of 90 seconds has a maximum capacity of 40,000 passengers per hour per direction compared to 3,000 passengers per hour per direction for the current peak hour 8 minute headway and 4 car trains and to an actual daily ridership of roughly 40,000 commuters. The train system is thus working at 
13.33% capacity and also well under the 110,000 rail passengers planned by 2010. In addition, with a fleet of 74 rail vehicles in the local yard to cover at least double the 10.7 mile system length and with all the basic facilities and capital equipment needed for the functioning in place, it is indispensable that the train be extended as it was originally intended to include higher density areas of the central district for it to be operationally successful and sustainable. Total number of lines is 1. Total number of stations is 16. Daily ridership is 18,600 of passengers. Annual ridership is 4,834,500 of passengers in 2017.